Thanks, Andy. Thanks, everybody, for, for coming. Thank you, John Shipton. Um, I work, some of you know me. I work for a German uh, online publication, the Nachdenkseiten. We've been on love covering this case over the years, more so since the beginning of the years, alerted by readers. And firstly, I want to read out a um, word of greeting from the German Julian Assange Defense Committee. There's uh, a few very energetic people doing this, and vigils are springing uh, up over Germany in a few places, so I read out their statement now. We send all our solidarity, positivity, and supportive energies to Julian Assange and his friends and family, to the Julian Assange Defense Committee, to Emmy Butlin, and all of the fine people who have been supporting Julian Assange for such a long time. Also to all supporters gathered today fighting for Julian Assange's life, for his freedom, press freedom and democracy. We are sending all our love and support to you today for the crucial fight inside and in front of Belmarsh. Free Assange Committee Germany is, all, is a small German group, still very new. We have only joined the fight in April this year. We do candles for Assange, vigils as often as we can try to inform the public, monitor the mainstream media, and demand reporting about Assange. Following the Julian Assange Defense Committee and your actions, it is an important help for us, a guidance. You are a role model for us and an inspiration. There you go, Emmy. Your permanent watch in front of the Ecuadorian Embassy is an act of humanity and commitment for which, for which we feel the deepest respect. It is hard to describe without sounding too corny, but for us these vigils show that certain humanistic values like kindness, compassion, fighting for a better world are still alive. It's probably uh, Kieran O'Reilly is meant by that. He has been great, great support and um, constant. So it's my uh, interruption. We are not sure if we get it all right, but eventually WikiLeaks is about constructing a better, peaceful world without wars. For this vision of peace, Mr. Assange is being held captive in Belmarsh and tortured in the most cruel, inhumane and outrageous ways. Each day he has to spend in his British Guantanamo is a crime against humanity. We want to do everything we can in order to protect Julian Assange, to protect press freedom, to help make his vision of a better world come true and to join your fight. So we stand with you outside the prison and we send all our love and solidarity to Julian, to Chelsea and to all of you. Free Julian Assange now! Free Julian Assange! Free Julian Assange! And now just a few words of mine. I've been yeah, also monitoring the kind of the developments and it's great to see you all here, so thanks for coming. Um, I think one, for me one big thing at the moment seems to be unity, that we stand united and the, we hear kind of funny rumors and crazy stuff is going on and that we, when we hear stuff like that, we kind of think about it and who could be putting this information out and that we um, think of the human beings that we have met here at the vigils and what is their purpose or what their, their aim is and judge that and not some strange information uh, that is spread around. So, uh, yeah, hum unity is really what, what is needed, I think. So, thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, everybody.